Hi Biggest Loser, my name is Sherry Halliland and I am a Biggest Loser contestant. Uh, I am part of Team Willpower uh, from Rochester, Minnesota. I'm 39 years old, 5 foot 11 and 326 pounds. I want to be on The Biggest Loser because I want to change my life. I want to be a great role model for my friends, my family, my children, uh, but most of all I want to live a happy, vibrant life. I'm outgoing, I'm very hard working, I'm really dedicated, I'm a successful career. Uh, this is the last frontier for me. I really need to get my weight under control and I want to help and support my friend Will in his journey towards wellness. Uh, I um, have decided to show you what my uh, body would look like in your weigh-in outfits. So this is me, 326 pounds. As you can see, I call it wingspan, uh, not arm length. Uh, I definitely am ready uh, to get fit. I'm ready to start this journey, and I really want you guys to pick me and Will to be on your next season, season 11 of The Biggest Loser. Uh, thank you very much for your time. Look forward uh, to being on the show and meeting your cast and crew. Uh, thank you for this opportunity. Does everybody know why I'm here? Yeah? Who's heard of The Biggest Loser? What? Let's go. Hey, if you've heard of The Biggest Loser. Hey! All right. So my name is Sherry Halliland, and I am Gabe's mom, and I am uh, applying to be a contestant on The Biggest Loser Season 11. So the new season of Biggest Loser starts on September 21st, that season 10, I would be on the next one if I get picked to be on the show. I'm part of a team called Team Willpower. So I'm, part, I, I'm, I'm partnering up with a friend of mine and a former coworker. His name is Will, and he has a weight loss journey um, as well. And we're working together to, uh, to get on the Biggest Loser campus together. Has anybody ever seen the Biggest Loser on television set? Yeah, yeah. It's pretty tough, right? So we're looking forward to getting on, but we know that we've got a big journey ahead of us. I'm 39 years old. I've been overweight my entire life. Uh, I want you to know that being an overweight kid was really hard. And I've struggled with weight my whole life. Um, I, I really look forward uh, to hearing from you guys. I'm sure you have some questions regarding how do you get on The Biggest Loser? Um, why did I want to be on The Biggest Loser? So I'm going to start it off by just asking uh, somebody, raise your hand if you'd like to ask me a question. All right. What will be your reaction if you win The Biggest Loser? Well, first of all, I'm not sure if you're aware of this, but there is a grand prize at the end where you win a lot of money. Is anybody motivated by money? Okay, so I would kind of like to make it to the finale um, so that I can win the money. Uh, but that is really just a secondary uh, component. My main goal for going on The Biggest Loser is to lose, is to lose weight and to have a he healthy life. Even if you don't get on The Biggest Loser, do you think you'll still be determined to lose weight? I love that question. So this really, this process of being on uh, as a contestant on The Biggest Loser has really put me in the spotlight. So I have a lot of pressure that even if I don't get on the show, I have a lot of people who want to support and encourage me in my weight loss journey. So I would absolutely be very determined to, uh, to lose weight despite not getting on the show. Yes? How did your weight affect your life at work? Well, I'm really proud of the job I have. I, I work for a great company. Um, I work for a great team. I have a great boss. Um, but that being said, being overweight in the workplace has some negative consequences. Um, I don't think people take me as seriously because I'm overweight. I don't think that, um, I, you know, I, I don't have as much energy as I wish I had. Um, even though I'm energetic at work, uh, I know that if I, if I lost weight um, and was a healthy weight, I would have a lot more um, energy at work. Um, and I really don't feel like I'm setting a very good example for the people who report to me. So I'm a boss at my job, and I'm not, um, I'm not setting a very good example to the people that work for me. So uh, that's the primary way I would say it affects me at work. Yes? What's the first thing you will do when you get home from the ranch? 
buy a new wardrobe. I would want to go to the mall and get all the clothes I want to buy, not just the clothes that fit me. I want to look super cute. Yes? What is the worst thing about being overweight? Uh, I would say the worst thing about being overweight is just being really uncomfortable. It's not, it's not fun being fat. And um, I would say that it's, it's, it's uncomfortable. Sometimes I don't fit in, in chairs, or sometimes I'm worried I'm going to break a chair if I sit on it. Um, I'm going to say that um, you know, I don't always get to pick the clothes I want to wear. Um, you know, I, I just I don't sleep as well as a person who's more fit. Um, and I don't, I don't have the energy to do the things with my family that I would like to do if I was a healthier weight. Yes. Why are you doing this? Primary goal for me is to be a good role model for my children, first of all, to get healthy um, and have a healthy life. I've got a long life ahead of me. 39 probably seems very old to you guys, because when I was your age, 39 seemed really old to me. Um, but I have a lot of life ahead of me, and I don't want to have the rest of my life ahead of me as an overweight person. Yes? If you make it onto the show, who do you want as a trainer, Bob or Jillian? Oh my gosh. Well, who, would you, who do you think I should have as a trainer, Bob or Jillian? Bob. Well, I'm not going to lie. I kind of like Bob. I have a little bit of a crush on Bob. But um, I think that my son Gabe is right. I think Jillian would really know how to whip me into shape. So I think I should probably, uh, I'd be happy with either one, but Jillian might have the best might, might have the best chance of improving my success at the ranch. Yes? What was the funnest part about the audition? I would say going to the state fair and meeting Sunshine and O'Neill was a really, really big um, and fun opportunity for me. Uh, if you don't know who they are, they're from Minnesota. They were on The Biggest Loser, and they lost a lot of weight and had a lot of success. Uh, they're both really healthy weight right now. Um, they're inspiration and role models to me. So I'm going to say um, being at the state fair and auditioning, but the bigger, um, I would say the bigger thing would be the support I've had from my friends and community. I didn't really know how many people were there to support me until I started this weight loss journey. So that would be the best. Yes. Are you ready for this? Yes, I'm ready for this. I have prepared mentally for this. I have prepared for my household and my children and my absence. Um, so I'm... I'm geared up. If I get picked, I am ready to go. I'm 100% ready. I don't know if America's ready for me, but I'm ready for this show. Yes. Why did you choose now to audition for Biggest Loser? That's a really great question. I think every year that I've watched The Biggest Loser with my own family, um, my kids have told me, Mom, you should try out for The Biggest Loser. You'd be really great on that show. And I think that, um, you know, they were, they were too little at the time for me to consider it. Uh, but when my friend Will um, contacted me and said, I need a partner to be on the show, um, I said, you know, I thought about it, I asked my family, and they said, go for it. When I knew I had their support, I decided now was the time. If I didn't do it now, I might never have the chance to do it again. Yes? Who's your biggest loser partner, and what is he like? His name is Will Aguero. I can honestly say he's one of the most sincere, fun, funny, lighthearted people I know. Um, he's very, very large. Will weighs 561 pounds. Um, so, you know, if you think about that, you know, how much do you guys weigh? Approximately, what, 70 pounds? Okay, so, so it would take about eight of you to weigh what Will weighs, right? So he's got, a, he's got an important journey that I support him on. I have an important journey. I want to lose 150 pounds at the ranch. So I have a big, I have a big goal. Yes.